There's one right there. Oh yeah. I'm John Thielen, host of Lindy's Fish Head Television. Man, this is one of my favorite ways to catch walleyes. Just pull crankbaits midsummer. But I want to tell you a little bit about the bait I'm pulling today because I think it's overlooked in the Midwest. It's known pretty well on the Great Lakes. But across the Midwest, I'll tell you what, this bait right here, this bandit walleye shallow is phenomenal. It's phenomenal for pulling on lead core. It's got a big, deep rattle. I mean, the fish can hear it. It's got awesome tight action and it's a big profile. And I'll tell you, this bait, this bait's kind of one of those hidden little secrets. I'm on Lake of the Woods today, and, and I'll tell you that here on Lake of the Woods last year, a big tournament was won on these baits right here on Lead Core. A lot of guys like to try to keep that a secret. They don't want everybody to know how they're getting it done tournament-wise, but I'll tell you that a lot of these guys are catching a lot of walleyes here on Lake of the Woods and across the Midwest and other inland bodies water, pulling bandit walleye shallows on lead core line. What makes a walleye love these things so much on lead core? Man, the action. The action is just perfect. It's got that tight little wiggle, and yet it gives you this big profile. Walleyes like this one, well, he ain't a giant. You know what? He's a great fish anywhere you go, 20 inch walleye. Get him out of here without getting hooked, and then I'll show him to you, and we'll get him back in the water. Then I'll show you this bait. Look at that. Great fish anywhere you go. Awesome fish, great eater. But you know what? Great tournament fish as well. That fish right there in slot tournaments is gold. He's just a hair under that 19, I bet. But this bait right here, boy, I'll tell you, this thing quickly has become one of my favorites when it comes to pulling lead. Like I was telling you while I was reeling in this fish, there's a couple of reasons. But one is that profile. I mean, it's a big, big profile and it catches big fish because of that. Big, deep rattle grabs their attention. I mean, that's what you want. You want a bait that when it's running, it's grabbing their attention. But man, I'll tell you, the other thing about it is it's got a whole pile of awesome colors too. Because remember, as these baits, these bandit walleye deeps and walleye shallows have been spawned out on the Great Lakes over the years, here's what's happened. We found out that all these crazy colors they work on inland waters just as well. So when you see all those fruit loopy type colors or, or you know, this one purple gold with some orange, a little bit of pink, whatever it may be, this one's flush. That's the name of the color is flush. Man, I'll tell you what, you can find that a lot of these colors catch fish day in and day out on your inland bodies of water too. If you're pulling lead core and you haven't pulled any of these bandit walleye shallows, I'll tell you what, you're missing out. You'll catch a lot of fish on these. You'll catch a lot of big fish. You'll catch eater fish as well. Man, I'll tell you what, it's an awesome bait. Make sure you pick a few of these up, try them next time you drop that lead core down. And hey, by the way, if you're fishing eight to 12 feet of water, that's what this thing dives to. It's got a great dive curve as well. So in the spring and in the fall, when those walleyes go back up shallow, it's an awesome time to pull a walleye shallow as well.